Hey guys, my name is Dan. Here we have a third party VST that is a MIDI FX and uh, Studio One. So right here, if you just want to pause it, you can just copy everything that I have and uh, you know, make sure this routing's right, make sure this routing's right, make sure Cthulhu's in its own window and the music instrument has an instrument. And that's how you route MIDI um, signals to from a third party MIDI FX plugin to control and manipulate or whatever your instrument. Okay, so anyways, I'll go into a little more um, explanation. New song, T for new track. So under instrument tabs, uh, under multi-instrument, just grab multi-instrument and um, throw multi-instrument right there. And then go to the third party VST MIDI effects plugin that you'd like to use, such as Cthulhu. And don't drop it in this big window. You actually go up to the, by the border here and drop it up here. And then go back to your musical interest, instrument tab and then grab whatever instrument you want. Double click for the instrument to show. And I have to grab a patch so this thing will make a sound. And hit a key. Okay, still no arpeggiator happening. So go back to the window. And uh, under multi-instrument tab, go up to where it says none, and then hit the MIDI FX plugin. That will route MIDI information from your third-party VST. And if you hit a key though, it's still not enough. Still doesn't isn't quite enough to make it work right. So you gotta run over to the track window and you gotta tell it here as well. So now if you hit a key, you got your arpeggiator. And um, that's pretty much the gist of it. And uh, I don't think that, uh, this is just real simple, so I don't think I'm actually missing anything as far as that goes. But anyways, uh, there's different MIDI channels here too. And so if you want, you can put more, in, more than one instrument in here. And for all intents and purposes, I believe you can put more than one MIDI effects tab in here and route the channels correspondingly to the instruments you want to affect. And you can do um, uh, a bunch of different stuff. So anyways, um, hope this helped. Thanks for um, checking me out and um, throw the video a like. Uh, and. Have a, have a great day.